My child, your home is cursed with shit. I wish I could laugh, but uh, I cannot. Yes, that rank odor is from the devil. The devil who produced me with this prick. Oh, that smell. He dips his arrows in cow dung and never washes. Uh, says it brings him luck. We're doomed to choke in father's shit house. The cow dung he keeps. It's in those crates. It has mutated into the most unholy of pungent monsters. Oh, oh. I need to be careful here.
see now. Something is not right. These berries are the only thing keeping me alive in the face of such a vile smell. Smells like a trap. Stink from those crates is gone, but in my experience, if you do not cure the sauce, shit returns. My father, Diggolas, he's a famous archer, but he never washes. Never. I'm going to confront him, that pox. Mother, I'm going to get father back. I've had enough. Change is in the air, literally. deadly, covered in shit. No one was complaining during war. Again, my beautiful Degolas. My love, you are finally clean. Our home also. Come here, my love. I can see your skin again. How does it feel to be clean again, Degolas? This clean feeling is strange to me. I was happy as a degenerate mudball. I never worried about these vain ventures. Your desires are not always those of your gods, your family, and your, well, those you lie with. I feel I've sold my war yourself. The grime inspired my bow. My shit arrows would strike fear into my foe's... nose. Well, I'm certain your arrows will still fly true. You did not lose your archer skill. Only time will tell. Be well, stranger.
my kingdom, wandering lord. I seek an alliance, one to benefit us both. This is the island kingdom of Nurthex. I am King Equald himself, lord and protector of this verdant land. This is your kingdom, you say? Indeed it is. Nurthex. And I am its first and reigning king, Equald. And as sovereign, I seek a keen ally to secure my strength. Kingdom. This island here. Yes, from shore to shore. My brothers and I came upon this unclaimed land some months ago, and found it suited to our ambitions. Sadly, my brothers were drowned in a terrible squall soon after, along with our riches. There was an arm ring among them. To you, I offer this arm ring in exchange for my loyalty. Find the ring among the wreck, and you may call a king your friend. A good arm ring can be as important as blood to the heart. If I find it, I will let you know. Find the ring among the wreck, and you may call a king your friend. See you, old friend. I found your arm ring amidst the wreckage of your ship. By all that is great, I cannot believe my eyes and ears. Now you are pledged to the kingdom of Northex. That will show him. Your past is dubious. I cannot trust a man who lost his brothers so easily and so suspiciously. What really happened? Nothing! The arm ring is mine! MINE! This kingdom was to be one of the greatest in England! The ring shine has blinded you! Now I blind you with blood, you supper! You have broken a sacred alliance with the greatest kingdoms! Knock the idiot down!
see me, this will get messy. Help me with this. My thanks. You have done right by me. Right. Let's get back to the ship. Uh. What's that about? Thank you so much.
Show me what lies ahead. Thanks, friend. Hey! Thank you so much, friend. Ah, friend, you have my facts. There was method to these cuts. Not bandit rapper, but a trained Saxon warrior. Your death. a good friend to me. Thank you. Ibien campo into septimo diluculo electric. Thank you enough.
wasn't knotted like a dying oak. Oh, that the will of Agnen Gathe der Anno. Itaque motorumque Christi Fidelium explentes, qui sinistra tristis teram atque, iluc vagabantur. Please, send me an angel, my lord. Oh, no. You have lost your apples. But I have. Oh, a devilish wind took me over, and I worry for them. But I've saved the finest and the juiciest. Oh, these apples explode in your mouth with the iridescent light of Jesus. What makes them special? An apple is an apple, no? Oh, I beg to differ, my friend. You see, every year we make the pilgrimage to the west. Hammer's farm. Farmer Hammer to the west? Yes, we call him the Hammer, and his apples are fine. Have this sweet iron tinge in them. My friends have already made it back. They are surely feasting already, but... I fell on some misfortune. My cart busted. Oh, me apple cart hath fallen! These apples must be eaten. They're too juicy to be left to rot. Se tibi erit ipse benedictus. Oh, eternal thanks for carrying the crate. I would be happy to share in the bounty of these apples with you, once we meet up with your friend. Oh, surely. We will share the Lord's work with you. The iron tinge, you will taste it. We all have earned it after fasting. Fasting? Is that when you lack food for your god? Yes, we show our devotion, remove distraction. But now, we give in to the fruits of our creator's work. Sharing an apple with a friend is the most sublime experience. Oh, oh. <laughs> it is nice to sometimes sit back and simply enjoy an apple. Well, with our fortune always changing in life, it's important to enjoy simple pleasures. <laughs> oh, I am so excited for you to see my friend and eat apples with us. The act of walking, the pilgrimage we're going on. We will prostrate ourselves for Guthlack at the end of this glorious pilgrimage, drown in his reward. Here we are, our tiny sanctuary. Join in prayer for the apples if you like. We bob. Bob? It is the only way to piously reap the reward of our Holy Father. Praise be to him. Ote conspecto hominum quale dilexit.
ego sum veride, qua actum amas de qui elegit ma ad... Oh! Brother Hogwolf! And you made a friend as well! Good to have you back!
around now. Blasted Winchell. Will he ever shut his mouth up there on his rock? We kicked Winchell up for good reason. Naked all the time. Unacceptable. Forget about him. That blasted Winchell. Will he ever shut his mouth up there on his rock? We kicked Winchell up for good reason. Naked all the time. Unacceptable. Forget about him. That blasted Winchell, will he ever shut his mouth up there on his rock? We kicked Winchell up for good reason. Naked all the time. Unacceptable. Forget about him. That blasted Winchell, will he ever shut his mouth up there on his rock? We kicked Winchell up for good reason. Naked all the time. Unacceptable. Forget about him. Great nudity to all tyrants of God. Let it be known you are vile garment mongers. And you will know my name is Winchell the Rogue Free. Why are you naked? Because my uncompromising lack of clothes brings me joy. Yet my very own sect of pious nudists tossed me aside. Nudists? Those who bear their skin for pleasure. Indeed, we, we bear our skin at all times, in the tradition of great Greeks and Romans. Yet some say I am too... enthusiastic. Nude in prayer, at mealtimes, at work, in the streets and alehouses, everywhere. For Jesus loves us best as we were born. But the group I founded has expelled me. Oh, if I could exact revenge, steal their clothes and render them nude forever, I would. That assembly of traitors act like all is well. well. One day, I will head down there and render them eternally nude, as God wanted. of skin. We are open to all who strip. Would you join us? I met a man who claimed to have created this club. What happened to him? Oh, Winchell. Yes. He was a bit too, um, <clears throat> assertive for us. He was overly tempted by bare flesh, so we had to send him away. I would be honored to join your group. Where do I place my clothes so I can start dancing? Wonderful! A new member. Simply place your clothes in that crate hidden by the tent and partake in the liberation. A fair day joins the ranks of the liberated. Oh, that's the crate where we put our clothes. Feel free to store yours in there too. Just put your... Hey! Stop that! Put... Our clothes! Leave them! Stop it, me! Go, me! Now you're nude forever, as Winchell wanted.
gorgeous beast of a soul joining us? Greetings, Dane. This is our private celebration of skin. We are open to all who strip. Would you join us? I would be honored to join your group. Where do I place my clothes so I can start dancing? Wonderful! A new member. Simply place your clothes in that crate hidden by the tent and partake in the liberation. There's a fresh, gorgeous... Oh, that's the crate where we put... Just put your... Hey! Stop that! Put it down! Now you're nude forever, as Winter wanted. Now they will adhere to your principles. Yes! You have carried out my revenge. Wonderful! Now they must revel in their nudeness forever. If you like, I have a luminous text with my teachings, a breviary of why one must trust their body's exposed sinew. Enjoy. Be well, Winchell the Chestry. <laughs> 